Hey guys, welcome to today's video. So today I actually have kind of a collective holiday body care haul. So this is a lot of affordable body care products that came from like Target or Walmart, places like that that have been recently pretty popular. So some of these scents that I'm going to go over are really great scents for Christmas. I'm super excited that they actually put out all this body care this year because it seems like we usually don't get this much holiday body care, but I'm very excited because some of the scents are really good. So I'm definitely excited to share these things with you and give you kind of my first impressions on some of them. And I actually have used a few of these products or I think one of them at least. So we'll go over all that and more. So if this sounds like something interesting to you, I would love if you stick around and watch this video. Also, if you do like content like this, I would love for you to take a moment and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. And we're gonna go ahead and get right into this video. All right, guys, so I'm going to start with the thing that I have taken out and used. So I haven't shown you guys this yet, but I have used it for the past two days. So this is the Frosted Plumberry Dove Soap. So I was super excited because I was able to get some Dove Soaps. You guys know if you've been watching my channel that I absolutely love the soaps and especially Dove Soaps and especially holiday soaps. I love that kind of thing. So I can only use bar soap though because my skin is very sensitive. So I can't use body washes or shower gels. Things like that tend to really rash my skin out. So I basically have to stick to body care. So I'm super excited they put out some holiday soaps this year because a lot of times they just put the body washes out and I need a bar soap. So so many brands have body washes that sound really wonderful, but they do not come in a bar soap version. Therefore, like I have never tried them. I just can't do body washes or shower gels, but this right here is a Dove bar soap. I have used this. So I actually took it out of here. It's not in here. It's gone. As you can see, it's gone. This is the Frosted Plum Berry Soap. This is a limited edition product from Dove, and this is actually available from Target. There are certain products that are available from Target only, and then there's also products available from Walmart. So it's like they have these two lines that Dove did this year for a holiday, and they're a little bit different. They have different scents at both stores. So this Frosted Plumberry one, I actually have used it and I do really like it. It does remind me of their Berry Brulee Bar Soap, which they came out with, I think, like last year. And that's one that sticks around pretty much all the time now. I do really like that one. It is a bit overpriced and these were overpriced as well. So it was, I think, $7 for one bar soap, which is quite high when you can get a full pack of regular Dove bar soaps for way less than that. So definitely a little bit higher in the price. The formula is really good though. I do like the formula of this soap and the soaps that come in these little boxes like the Berry Brulee one as well. That's a natural based bar soap. I don't know. I think this one is a natural based bar soap as well and that's why they're charging the same price for it. So let's read the back of this one. So this is a limited edition holiday treats. Bring a bit of holiday magic to your shower routine with this wintry blend of frosted plum and sponge sugar. Let the velvety lather gently cleanse and nourish your skin for the holiday glow it deserves. Make every shower feel like a winter wonderland. No earmuffs needed. Plant-based cleansers, pH balanced, no sulfate cleansers, and one-fourth moisturizing cream. So yeah, this is like one of their natural bars. This smells really good. So it does remind me of the Berry Brulee scent if you are familiar with that one from Dove. But otherwise, it's like a really nice berry scent. I think it's a really sweet berry scent. And then you do get more plum in here too. So you have like a berry plum mix, which is really nice. It kind of feels a little bit more festive than just berries. It's actually giving me like a little bit more holiday feels. And I love that. And I love that about products. 
So yeah, this smells really good. You do get like a really sugary touch of something and it is a little bit creamy as well. I don't know if that's the frosted part of this or what, but there's definitely kind of like a creaminess to this. It's kind of like a creamy berry scent, but you do get that little burst of plum as well. So I really like this one. This is really smelling good to me. I could really use this any time of year, honestly, because it is like a creamy berry scent almost. It does have that little hint of plum though. So I do really like that. I like how these bars look too. And these bars are a bit bigger than like a regular Dove size bar. So I do really like this cleanser. I've never gotten any like rashes or anything from these Dove soaps that come in these boxes like that. So I've been really enjoying it. I use it for the past two days in the shower and I absolutely love it. The scent lingers slightly on the skin, but it's not too much or anything. Like I used a vanilla scent over it today and you know, it smells really good. I really am enjoying this scent in the shower, but I do like berry scents. So definitely keep that in mind because if you're not a big berry lover, you may not like this one as much. They did come out with some other scents as well in this bar soap. So I did pick up one other one, but I am planning to pick up the last one as well. So the other one that I picked up is this gingerbread delight one. I think this one's super cute. So I have not tried this one out yet or used it on my body or anything like that. They do have a little spot right here where you can smell through the actual box and it smells really good this smells like a sweet gingerbread there is a little spice in there but it's not too heavy it smells delicious this actually does smell more like a gingerbread cookie so this one is called gingerbread delight this one is a limited edition one as well so this is part of their holiday treat collection so it says treat yourself to the sweet nostalgic scent of gingerbread cookies fresh out of the oven let the aroma of softened butter sweet molasses and candied ginger gently cleanse and nurse your skin for the holiday glow it deserves so definitely excited that this one's not too spicy i do love a gingerbread scent but i don't like when it's too spicy i don't like a super super spicy gingerbread scent but this one is giving cookies this you can actually get like some gourmandness through. This actually smells like a gingerbread cookie. So I'm super excited to use this, but I do want to wait a little bit longer till it gets a little closer to Christmas. That's actually why I started with the frosted plumberry one. So they actually do have another soap and I'm after that one as well. I'm probably going to pick that one up this week. They have a hot cocoa one, which I am super excited about. I think it was called Hot Cocoa Swirl. I will put a picture of that one up here so you guys can see that one as well. But it's like a chocolate, um, like a hot chocolate scent. So I'm really excited for that one too. But so far I've only picked up these two because the Hot Cocoa one was sold out when I did my order for these. But this is smelling really good. I can't wait to try this one out in the shower as well. And I'm definitely enjoying that plum one quite a bit. So I also picked up another scrub. I really kind of overdid the scrub. So I'm going to have to be using like a scrub almost every day so I can get through some of these. But these are too good to pass up in my opinion. Well, some of them, some of the ones that I got in my first haul, I probably could have done without. The chai one was very spicy. The sugar cookie one's good, but it's just not giving the type of cookie that I am after but the chocolate mint one the peppermint bark dove scrub that one is so good it smells so realistic and so gourmand so this one is the frosted plumberry and this is the one from target i actually got the peppermint bark one from walmart like i said there's basically like two lines of holiday releases from dove and there's a bunch at walmart and then there's different scents at target so definitely make note of that because some of these products are available in one place and not the other and vice versa so this is the frosted plumberry in the scrub and I have not used this one. I did use the bar soap like I told you guys. I'm not going to read the notes or anything again since I just did read them but this is what the front looks like. It's super cute. 
I really like this plum scent. I think it smells really good. I don't think I'm going to pick up any more scrubs because I actually have a few more scrubs to show you guys during this video too. So you will see that I got pretty much way too many scrubs at this point for the holidays. So I need to be using them. Okay, so this is the scrub. I'm going to show you guys the inside. So this is what the inside looks like. It's just a regular Dove scrub. They pretty much all have the same consistency, in my opinion, all these holiday ones anyways. It's more of a body polish, in my opinion. So this is giving the same as the bar soap. It's like a plum berry scent, but there's definitely a creaminess in here. And it does kind of make you think of the holidays, but you could definitely use this scent any time of year. This smells really good. It's very, very sweet. You definitely get the berry. I think I get the berries more than the plum in this scent, but it's still a really wonderful scent. If you do like a berry type of scent or plum scent, I would definitely recommend trying this one out because I really love this scent. I think it smells really delicious. So I did pick up some other scrubs as well, like I told you guys. So I got these two little mini scrubs from Dove. I think these ones might have came out last year as well, but I never picked them up. They actually do have a third scent in these mini scrubs as well. They have like a winter mint one and I actually passed on the winter mint one. So I will put a picture up right here so you guys can see what the winter mint scrub looks like, but it's another little mini scrub. These were $5 each, so not too bad. They are a lot smaller, though, than the big scrubs. I will show you a comparison. So this is the mini scrub, and this is the Dove big scrub. So there's quite a big difference here. And it's really not a huge price difference because I think the scrub's like seven, and then um, these are five. So you actually do get a lot more scrub in this big jar let's see so the big jar is 10.5 ounces and this little jar is 3.5 ounces so you definitely get a lot more product in these bigger scrubs but i just want to try out these little scrubs because i haven't tried them before so this one right here is in the scent frosted cranberry it's super cute too. It has all this little shimmering on it and glitter. Like, I don't know if you guys can see that by just looking at this, but I think it's really cute. It's really cute. So that's the front. So I have not smelled this. I haven't used it, nothing. So the frosted cranberry scent doesn't look like it has any kind of description. At least it's on this anyways. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and open this up and give you guys kind of a first impressions. So this is what it looks like. It's about the same color as the plumberry one. It's almost exact color, actually, as the plumberry one that we just looked at. So the scent is definitely different. This is more of like a tart cranberry. I think it smells really good, though. This does smell kind of edible. You definitely get that cranberry in here. And as far as frosted, I'm not sure. I'm pretty much just getting cranberry. So it's a nice cranberry scent. It's not too tart or too sweet. It's kind of right in the middle. So it's a really nice cranberry scent. I definitely look forward to using this one and doing maybe some routines with it. And then this other one that I picked up is the hot cocoa scent. So like I said, they do have a hot cocoa swirl scent. I think that's a little bit different though. And that one I believe comes in the bigger scrub and it also comes in the bar soap and probably the body wash as well. But this is just the little mini hot cocoa one. And I think they had this one last year as well, but I never picked it up. So let's go ahead and look at the, the inside of this one. So it's a nice like brownish cocoa type color. Ooh, so as far as scent, this smells very chocolatey. Definitely get that burst of chocolate right in your face. It's almost giving like a chocolate pudding type scent. But I really like it. It's like a milk chocolate, I guess you would say. Kind of a milk chocolate scent. I definitely plan to pick up that 
hot cocoa bar soap as well. So that would probably be a really good routine to do with this little mini scrub. So let's see what else I got. I actually picked up some Body Ecology products that were more holiday related because some of you guys did suggest these in the comments. So right here I have this one and this is missing my cap at the moment because I'm trying to remove the adhesive from the top. They put a piece of tape all the way around it in shipment and I'm having a really hard time getting the plastic off the clear top. I've used like everything. I've used alcohol, I've used nail polish remover, I've used vinegar, like I cannot get that adhesive off. So right now I just don't have a cap on this one, but I wanted to try this one out. Someone did recommend this in the comments to try the frosted berry scent and said that they were better than the Victoria's Secret scents, which I wanted to try out. I haven't tried a whole lot of Body Ecology products, but I have tried some in the past. I do have the Cozy S'more Body Ecology scent up in my collection back here. And I also do have the Watermelon Splash scent as well, but those are both in the older packaging. If you use Body Ecology products, you probably know that they did do kind of a revision to their packaging in this last year. They look a lot more like Bath and Body Works products now, the size, the way they look, and you know, with the cap on it looks even more so, but I'm missing my cap because I'm having issues getting that adhesive off. I did use this yesterday. On the front it says sweet wild berries and whipped cream, and then on the back it says wrap yourself in the comforting scent of cozy musk, fresh citrus, and frosted berries. So I don't have my cap. I'm just going to kind of mist it in the air. And some kind of got on me, but that's okay. I'm wearing another scent, but I can still smell it through that. So I think this is a really good berry scent. I do really like this berry scent. It smells really good. It's like a mixed berry scent and it's almost candy-like in my opinion. I'm definitely getting kind of like a candiness from this and I'm thinking maybe the frosted part is giving it that. I'm not really sure, but it almost smells like it kind of reminds me almost of like sweet tarts in a way. Not full on sweet tarts. There's definitely like a mixed berry aspect in there. I'm not getting a whole lot of creaminess. Like it says that the notes have whipped cream in here as well, which I'm not getting a heavy whipped cream note, but that's perfectly fine for me because I like berry scents just, you know, as is. There probably is like a slight whipped cream. Maybe that's what's adding that sweetness to here. I think this is a really good scent and I do really enjoy it. But to me, the longevity wasn't quite there. It lasted, but I had to keep spraying myself down. Like I did notice a pretty big difference with that compared to my Victoria's Secret and Bath and Body Works mists. Like a lot of times they will last almost all day long. Whereas this one, I felt like it kept fading off. But I do have to say the scent of this is really, really good. It's a really nice berry scent. I do really enjoy using this one. Since the longevity really isn't cutting it for me. I think I might try to blend this into maybe more combos and things like that. Wear it with other scents and see how that goes. But let me know what you guys think of this Body Ecology Frosted Berries scent. If you have tried that one, go ahead and let me know in the comments. I would love to know your opinion on this as well. Next up, I do have a scrub that I've been talking about for quite a while and I was kind of nursing the end of my scrub. I just put it in my empties and then they announced they're coming back with the same scrub, which I was super excited about because I was trying to save the last of my scrub until this year and use it up. But now I have another one. So this is actually a Target exclusive as well. And this is the Cinnamon Dolce Scrub from Tree Hut. I do have or it does have this plastic on it right now. So I probably need to take that off. I'll be back in just a minute. All right, guys, so I am back and I have this scrub right here. So this one was released, I believe it was last year and I just fell in love with this scrub. I think this is one of the best Tree Hut scrubs there is. This smells so good. So this is a Cinnamon Dolce 
scent and it's so good. It's like so gourmand. Yeah, so that's that is what I remember. So this is very cinnamon like it's very gourmand very very much cinnamon but it's not like a spicy cinnamon it's more like a buttery cinnamon so it's like giving kind of like a fall bakery vibe this one is so good though I have to recommend this one to you guys because this is seriously like my favorite scent from tree hut I would probably have a hard time using this in spring and summer, but fall and winter, I am all here for this one. This is so good. It's just this cinnamon buttery goodness. And I love using this one in the shower. It's so fragrant. It smells good. I think these actually work better than the Dove Scrubs. The Dove Scrubs actually work more like a polish. And this is actually more like an actual scrub. Like there's a lot more grit in this. The grit's a lot harsher. So it's just... A whole different type of scrub but I do enjoy both of them overall tree hut scrubs are my favorite and this scent is like beyond my favorite I absolutely love this scent next up I actually picked up a little body ecology gift set so this was only five dollars and it comes with some little fuzzy socks you can actually feel them right through here and then it came with a little body cream and a little fragrance mist. But the reason why I got this is because this is in a gingerbread scent. And I've been having trouble finding a gingerbread scent that I actually like. I do like the warm cookie scent from Victoria's Secret Pink. But to me, it doesn't give a whole lot of gingerbread. And I don't like a really spicy gingerbread either. So I like this gourmand cookie gingerbread. So I'm hoping that's what this is going to be. So we're going to open this up. Actually, it has a little scratch and sniff right here. I didn't even notice that. I can't smell it, though. So this was $5 at Walmart. So you guys can get these, too. All right, guys. So I am back, and I have the little gingerbread latte spray. And this is from Body Ecology again. It was in that set for $5. I think they have little stocking stuff for things that are like three bucks that you can get like the combo in as well. I just got this one because it was the first one that I saw on there that I could have shipped to me. Sometimes the products say you can only pick them up like the smaller items like the three dollar one said I could only pick that up and I wanted it shipped since I have a hard time making it to the stores so I just got this one. But the scent says that the notes are warm cinnamon, vanilla, and ginger. So that sounds good. It sounds like it's going to be more of like a gourmand gingerbread fragrance. So the back just says this holiday classic is brought to life with warm cinnamon, vanilla, and ginger. So I'm super excited to smell this one, but I'm a little nervous too because I can't find a really great gingerbread scent that I really love. So I'm hoping maybe this is it. So I just sprayed it in the cap. I'm going to let it sit because I have noticed with the Body Ecology fragrances, they smell a lot more like alcohol when you first spray them. So you got to just kind of let them dry down and then they're good to go though. They smell really good after that. So I am getting a lot of alcohol right now in this. So I'm thinking I might have to come back to this because it just smells like straight alcohol right now. So I'm going to try spraying it on a paper. So just one second. All right. So now I'm going to try to spray it on this paper because it's just not drying really in the cap very well. So I'm hoping I'll get a better impression off this paper. So that's kind of disappointing. I'm really not getting anything. This is quite light for sure. So yeah, this definitely isn't really what I was expecting. Not really getting much gingerbread in here at all. It just is smelling like alcohol. Like you get a little bit more maybe once it starts drying. Let's come back to that at the very end and see maybe what that smells like. So I 
it does have the little it does have the little body lotion here too but I can't use this on my body. I rash out when I use body collagy lotions, but I'm just going to use a tiny bit. I don't think it'll matter if it's on my hands, but I want to get a better impression of this scent. So yeah, I don't know. This one just, I'm not really feeling this one. This is giving strong alcohol. And I'm just not really liking this one. It just doesn't really give me gingerbread. Like at all. So I don't I don't know what's up with that, guys. I don't know. So this is just really smelling like a lot of alcohol. Now I'm kind of bummed out because I was really hoping to find a great gingerbread scent. But this definitely is not it. So I'm not liking this one. Let me know what you guys think of it if you have tried this one. But this it just smells like alcohol like i'm really not getting any gourmand notes i'm not getting gingerbread i'm not getting cookie it's just this like alcohol smell so we're gonna have to figure that out this body collagen one this one was good like i smell this right away when you spray it even though you do get a burst of alcohol it dries down and it smells really good whereas this gingerbread one I'm just getting straight alcohol from this and it's not drying down it's not smelling really like anything else so that might have been kind of a dud I guess you would say like that was not that was not you know that was like a miss because this I don't know it just doesn't smell good it doesn't smell good in my opinion I mean maybe if it dried down but even the lotion it's just not smelling good Okay, so I just have a few more products to show you guys. So I actually have this little tiny lip therapy um, Vaseline. I thought this was super cute. I actually wanted to get the creme brulee one, but I just got the sugar cookie one because they were out of the creme brulee. That might have been from last year or some other time, but I didn't expect it to be so small. Like this is so small. But I think it's cute and I'm hoping that it will be good for me. This is just a holiday product that I thought looked super cute. And I always have to put some kind of Blistex or Vaseline on my lips before I put lip products because my lips get very dried out otherwise. Sorry guys, I had to take a quick break because my son just got home from school. They actually have half days this week so he gets out early every day this week so i had to go down and greet him and everything and now i am back so i only have a couple more things to show you guys so one of them's not even body care related so i did end up picking up this this is the eos cashmere skin shave butter and this has a cashmere smooth complex it says so i usually use eos shaving products but i use the one with the pump i think it's in the scent vanilla bliss is the one that i usually get but i do kind of rotate like i have gotten the raspberry pomegranate one and they did have a citrus one a long time ago that i did get as well i pretty much use that all the time but i saw this one and i wanted to try it out i actually thought maybe this was in the scent the vanilla cashmere scent like the same as the lotion because i really like that scent i think it smells really good but now that i have this it doesn't really say that it smells like vanilla or anything it says there's a cashmere smooth complex so maybe i misread that but hopefully this will still be good for shaving and all that so I'm going to just put a little on my hand just to see if it does smell like the vanilla one because I thought that this one would, but I'm thinking maybe it won't now. So I don't really smell anything with this. Yeah, so this isn't really giving a smell. I was really excited because I thought this was going to be in that vanilla cashmere scent, but I'm really not getting that at this point. So I don't know. We'll see, but I'll use it, of course, and 
see how it goes. And then the last thing is not even body care related, but this is super cute and I thought it smelled really good. So I love the Mainstays candles from Walmart. They're really, really cheap and they burn really well. They put off a good smell. Not every single one of them does put off a good smell, but a lot of them do. So I wanted to tell you guys about this one that I got right here. So this is the holiday gingerbread scent. This was only like $5.90 something, almost $6, but it's a big three wick candle and it's super cute. So the notes on here are orange, ginger, and allspice. And it's super cute. It has all these little candy canes and gingerbreads and stuff on them. So super cute. These are three wick candles and they have only a plastic lid. So the lid's not the greatest quality but they smell really good. So I actually have smelled this one and it smells delicious. This smells just like gingerbread cookies. Like why can't they make body care that smells just like this? Because this smells really good. Yeah. So this is kind of the gingerbread I'm after. Kind of a bummer. I can't find any good body care with a gingerbread scent, but this smells really good. So my house will be smelling great. I really like this one. This one really does give it me like these seasonal feelings. Like it makes you think of Christmas. And it seems like there's a little touch of something else in there as well. Like maybe, you know, it almost smells like gingerbread with like a little more cinnamon or something like that, but it's smelling really good. It's super cozy and comfy smelling. They did come out, I think, with some other Christmas scents as well. So you might want to check those out. Like I said, they're really reasonable. This one right here was like $6. They actually have some for $4 that are smaller and don't have a lid. So I love these candles. Let me know what you guys think of them. Last but not least, we're going to go back and we're going to smell that gingerbread scent again. So I have it right here and I'm kind of bummed out because it really wasn't smelling like gingerbread at all, but here it is again. So I'm going to smell the cap. Hopefully it dried down. So I'm still not getting, I'm still really not getting what I want to in this. Like this is not what... This is not what I thought it was going to be. Like, this is just not where it is. Yeah, I just, I, I don't like this one. There's really no scent. It's overpowered with alcohol. It's just not, not that great at all. I would definitely have not gotten this if I smelled this first. Like, if I had the chance to smell this first, there's no way I would have purchased this. The gingerbread latte scent sounded like it would be incredible but sadly it's really not. It's just really alcohol and whatever other smells in here is so light that the alcohol is really just overpowering it. And the lotion that I put on my hand, like I don't smell it on that either. I'm going to spray it on my hand real quick just to kind of see. Okay, so I'm just letting that dry. So I get a little bit more gingerbread when I put it on my skin. But this just isn't, there's barely any scent here. So that's just kind of disappointing. Yeah, that's like the most disappointing gingerbread scent I think I've ever gotten. At least the other gingerbread scents that I've purchased in the past actually smell like something. Whereas this seriously smells like nothing. Like it seriously smells like I sprayed nothing. Like it was like an unscented mist or something because I'm not getting anything. And that's not to judge Bodycology because like I said, this frosted berry scent, I thought this was pretty good. This is probably, you know one of their best scents that I have tried from there for a long time. And this one is just really sweet and berries. It smells pretty realistic, whereas the gingerbread is just totally not there. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video, though. Definitely let me know what you picked up for the holidays down below in the comments. If you picked up anything 
really great or anything in body care that you want to share with everyone, we would love to know. Go ahead and drop it in the comments. If you did enjoy this video, go ahead and give me a big thumbs up. If you do enjoy this type of content, I would definitely love for you to take a moment and hit that subscribe button. I do new videos every single week and I would love to have you as a subscriber. I love you guys so much. I hope you have a beautiful day and I will see you in the next video.